Hello everybody, I'm Oracle with your Fix It Auto and today I'm going to be showing you how I'm going to be prepping the vinyl in my Supernatural Tribute car. So this material is actually a little bit different than plastic. It requires a different preparation process. So what we're going to need here today is we're going to need some soapy water in order to clean off the vinyl. We're going to need some vinyl prep and make sure to use gloves because this stuff eats away at your, at your hands. Make sure you have the correct paint. And the one that I use is the 15093 buckskin, light buckskin color from SEM. This is the correct color, an adhesion promoter, and then a low luster clear coating just to protect the paint. Okay, and of course a scotch bright. That way with the soapy water we can go through and we can actually clean this very well and prepare it. And of course make sure to use a mask and be in a well ventilated area so I am outside today. So the first step that we're gonna do, so we're gonna go through and we're gonna clean with soapy water, clean this entire surface very thoroughly. We wanna make sure all dirt and grime is gone. As you can see here, there is some dirt buildup that we wanna make sure is gone. Then grab a clean microfiber cloth, just go through and wipe it down. Okay, look at all the dirt that we're taking off the vinyl. After we've gone through and cleaned this, next we're gonna use a vinyl prep by the same company that makes the paint, SEM. So we're gonna go through and evenly spray. We're gonna to wanna to let that sit for a few minutes, but at the same time we don't want it to sit for too long because that does eat away at the vinyl, probably about three, four minutes, and then you can start wiping it off. And now with a clean microfiber cloth, I'm just gonna go through and wipe this down. Now, if you notice closely, we have some parts that are folded over. Pretty much anything that is outlined just like this is gonna be hidden. This, this is all gonna be tucked underneath. So you won't be seeing that anyways, but still, I like to know that that part is painted over as well. So I'm just gonna fold it over, spend some time, and make sure that this is flat and that the surface is paintable. And now that this has spent time in order to dry, I'm going to hit it with a plastic adhesion promoter, which says here it's also good for vinyl. So I'm gonna go through and spray this. And we're just gonna wait about three minutes and then reapply a second coat, three more minutes, apply a third coat, and then we're gonna go over with our official color. And then after the third coat of adhesion promoter, then within 10 minutes of using the adhesion promoter, you're gonna to want to apply the paint. So here's where our light buckskin color comes into play. When you're gonna to wanna to spray to the side a little bit. That way you know it's paint that's coming out. I'm gonna be doing light coats only. I'm not gonna spray it on thick, otherwise it'll run. I'm gonna wait five to 10 minutes in between coats until this product looks exactly how we want it to. And don't be afraid to put light coats. It'll eventually turn out. Just be sure to get it from different angles. After three light coats, I was able to get the look that I wanted. So next I'm gonna hit it with a clear coat in order to protect the paint. Make sure to do nice, even, steady strokes. And then I'm gonna hit it with two coats of this. And then after two light coats of the clear coat, now I'm done. And that's really all there is to it. This is how the product turned out. And you can apply the same method to the door panel, the dash pad as well. Just any vinyl that you can find in the interior, including the headliner. Now I'll be doing a whole separate video on the headliner considering how large that item is, but that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like the video or find it useful, please give it a like, subscribe, and share. And as always, you can always find products linked down in the description below. And let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching.